get every day now, bro. I swear, you know, I didn't hear nothing except the drilling sound right now. That's what got me up. Good morning, sir. Good. Please tell me your name. Joseph. Your last name? Joseph. Last name A L C A L A. Okay. And you live at this residence where there was a fire. What happened? Uh, I live in the back. I live in a studio. Uh, I woke up to my yelling, screaming, and when I woke up, I, I saw the redness. And through my window, when I got outside my door, I just saw the garage engulfed in flames. And at that time, I thought I could put it out with the, with the water hose, or at least keep it from spreading. And I just kept on trying to water it down until I heard the fire engine come, and from there they just came over and took over. Did your uh, studio catch on fire? No, I was watering it down to keep it from, from any flames or any debris falling on it. I kept the roof wet. Yeah, so it looks like the fire went from the garage to the two homes in front. Yeah, it, it looked that way. And I, and I tried to keep it from getting to that part, too. I tried to keep the, the house wet. You know. Any, any clue how the fire started? Mm, oh, I, I got a cousin that stays in there sometime. He might have been doing something in there and okay. lighted something on fire or caught on fire. We'll, we'll leave that up to the investigators. Yeah. But I'm so sorry this happened to you and your family. And you said it's your uncle that lives here? Yeah, it's my uncle and, my, and some of my cousins and family there in the front. You know, luckily nobody got hurt. Nobody was... Okay, that was my next question. Nobody got hurt? No, nobody got hurt. No. Okay. Sir, I'm so sorry this happened to you. Thanks, you know, I appreciate it. Thank you so much for your time. You're welcome. like it maybe started in the garage or the carport area, extended into the house next door and into the interior of the house where the car was. Yeah, we have pretty heavy damage. We also have truck destroyed. A uh, vehicle, yes. Any injuries? No injuries. And do we have a cause yet? We do not. We have uh, bomb arson on the way and it'll do the investigation. Okay, so bomb and arson come out. Now we saw one man being detained. Do you know anything about that? I do not. My understanding is he may be a family member or an estranged family member, but I don't know. Yeah, again, you said no injury to anybody. No injury. Any 
idea how long you folks will be here? I'm sorry? Any idea how long you folks will be here? Uh, we'll be here for a little while longer, probably another hour, hour and a half. Anything you'd like to answer? Nope. Thank you so much for your time. All right, thank you.